Hey, what's up everybody? It's Trent with Bully Barn. All right, running through some pups here off of Grand Champion Buckus and River. Also have a couple in this video that will be off of Grand Champion Buckus and Kiss. Some of the pups off of the litters will not be on this video just because they are not available and some of these pups may not be available either. So if you're interested, you guys know what to do. Screenshot this video, shoot me a text of the pup you want, uh, however you guys want to do it. But check out these pups, kind of displaying some of their top line, some of their structure and stuff to let you guys get a good look at them. Beautiful pups. There'll be video near the end of this video of all of the pups playing around in the puppy pen. We let them kind of enjoy the day out today. It was about 75 degrees, so they got to play around and enjoy themselves. Here's a video of the chocolate female off of River and Buckus. I'll also set another female down here in a second that's black and white also off of River and Buckus. Um, so you'll get some video of separate females, but you'll get to see all the pups near the end of the video kind of playing around and having a blast. But yeah, I just want to let you guys get a look at them. Look at this girl's movement. Absolutely beautiful. Love this girl. Getting her confidence up. Having fun, playing around, hitting a little free stack every now and then. I love this girl's coloring. Super pretty. Get a little pep in her step there. There's Spirit in the background. This little female here is off of Grand Champion Buckus and Kiss. She's really beautiful. Stocky, good bone, pretty headpiece, short back. I think she's gonna be really clean as well. She's very nice. Girl has really smooth movement. There, she got a little pep in her step there. She, this, this girl's super cute. Now all these puppies will be chocolate carriers and tri carriers regardless, because Buckus is actually a chocolate tri. He just has dominant black, which is a gene that basically makes a solid color and covers up the tri points. But Buckus is actually a chocolate tri. So all of Buckus's puppies are chocolate carriers and tri carriers. But yeah, check out this little female. She's super nice. So guys, I got a cool idea. We've been thinking about doing a bi-weekly video basically just call it a dog breakdown you guys find a stud that you really like we'll break the dog down break the pedigree down talk about pros and cons and whatnot and basically take some of the guesswork out for some of you guys that are diving down deep into pedigrees and different dogs and and searching and whatnot i think it'd be a pretty neat video and i think a lot of people would love that kind of content so you guys comment below tell us what you think about that i think that's a great idea but we're going to keep this video rolling so you guys can check out this female and some other females. But you guys have seen plenty of movement on this female. So here's the pups playing. I told you guys I would get you guys a little bit of video near the end of the video of just all the pups kind of playing around the puppy pen. Like I said, they got some good time outside today. Another video we plan on shooting soon is going to be a video of some of our dogs that we've sold overseas. A couple to China, some to the UK, and they've absolutely turned out gorgeous. Just beautiful dogs. So we're super excited about that. We'll post some pictures and stuff up of those dogs and do a separate video on that. Basically like a big update litter on our inbreedings off of Samson that turned out really great. We've got some other content ideas and stuff as well that we're going to try to put out. I know I've been slacking on videos, but you guys bear with me. We've been trying to figure out what we can do about finishing this facility up and stuff. So we'll get some stuff rolling before long, guys. So I love the temperament on all these pups. It was really easy introducing these pups from, you know, two different whelping boxes because it's two different litters. So when we finally brought them together, they did well. They weren't fighting a bunch or anything like that. So they all have great personalities, great demeanors, temperaments. So that makes it a breeze, you know, putting pups together off of two different litters. And we do have some other breedings that will be going down before long. We're not going to announce those yet because um, we're not exactly sure and concrete on which studs we're going to be using. We have backup studs as well. 
but we'll make a video and probably post about that before long as well we're going to start getting pretty heavy into the youtube we've just been slacking a lot lately guys so sorry about that but like i said i was going to get you guys good footage off of these two litters and these pups are absolutely gorgeous playing around having a blast just enjoying the day we're ready for some nice warmer weather too ready to smell that fresh cut grass and the dogs love it too man like I said earlier in the video, guys, we've got the facility and stuff that we've been kind of in the process on and off on building in between litters and different stuff like that. We've just been super busy. But concrete foundation and drains will be going in soon, so we're super stoked about getting some update videos on that. Also going to shoot a video of some of our super nice up-and-coming Dual Grand Champion Buckus Productions, including our up-and-coming stud. Phenomenal dog. If you guys have any questions feel free to text me at 405-568-6846. Follow us on Instagram at bully.barn.b. Follow us on Facebook at Bully Barn. You guys have a good one.